There's a flurry of activity at the Mount Rose Ski Resort. The lift lines are long, the parking lot is full, and the lodge is crowded. Sometimes you can just kind of go somewhere and just have fun. No one, you can never have fun em, enough. Resort spokesmen say the lack of natural snow so far this season hasn't left them out in the cold. You know, the demand is there and we, we were able to make plenty of snow so that their experience this winter is, you know, is great. And it's actually very nice out. People love it when it's when it's this kind of temperature. These near perfect conditions are drawing in tourists by the dozens, all who don't seem to mind the machine blown flakes. I know there's no snow. It's, it's, it's what it is. <laughs> you know, we've been uh, we've been blessed with good snow for, for the last few years and now we're going back to a little less snow. Are you still having fun out here? Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. The resort delayed their opening this season by a few weeks, but says their sales numbers are still piling up, even if the snow isn't. All in all, it's been strong. We're, we're still doing very positive numbers. People are having a good time. At this time last year, Tahoe was buried under more than seven feet of snow. Today, forecasters say this could be the driest December this region has seen in years. Yet thanks to the snowmaking machines, Mount Rose has terrain open from the top of the mountain to the base. A pleasant surprise to those looking to show off their skills. It's nice. Uh, there's a lot more snow than we thought there would be driving up. You know, you see the bare hills and when you come here up here, there's a lot, a lot of snow on these slopes. So it's, it's nice. Obviously, ski officials here at Mount Rose are hoping for more snow in the near future, but they're also hoping skiers and snowboarders remember the resort is open till April. At a later date in the season, you may be able to find fewer people, shorter lines, and hopefully, fingers crossed, a lot more snow. Reporting from Mount Rose, Shannon Moore, Fox 11 News.